Libras to see what's happening for love. This is the month of March reading, the love reading. This is the first time. Congratulations to all the winner and um so much congratulations guys because this was a surprise and it's so beautiful that you guys are here congratulations i love you guys okay let's look at the aquarians the aquarians love reading for the month of march 2019 so someone can put a, a time stamp for the aquarian i'm gonna break it up anyway so um we can still do the time stamp okay so let's check out the Aquarians. What's happening for the Aquarians for the love reading for the month of March? What do we have in the first week for the Aquarians? Some of you blonde ladies are up in the first week. Okay, let's look at um, who else is coming up. Okay, we have the mature women. That is the women 45 years and older is coming up in love also. And then we have... I love triangle coming up in the first week. Some of you are going to be finding out that there is a love triangle. You might be going through this love triangle. We are going to be seeing who it's affecting, okay? In the second week, what do we have? We have friendship. We have friendship, so friendship might turn into love. We're going to be looking to see what's happening with that friendship. We also have fun times so some of you could be some of you mature ladies could be having some real fun times in the second week third week the ladies who likes or the people who likes to uh, just date the dating queen it's going to be a good month for you dating queens you're coming out in the second week and you are going to definitely cre creating a love triangle oh my I love this. Okay, let's see what's happening in the third week. Some of you are going to be meeting your twin flame or soulmate. So you Aquarians that are looking for soulmates in the third week, they are going to be coming out. Let's see what else is coming up in the fourth week. Um, the energy of the family comes up in the fourth week. Okay, so alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, so we are going to be checking out the love energies for you guys. So let's go ahead and see what is transpiring in all these four weeks with all you Aquarians. Okay. I'm really loving this deck. I just did a review. If you like this deck, check out the review. It's really, um, it's a uh, Amira um, love deck, Amira love oracle. And it's so beautiful. I'm so in love with this deck. And I decided to do the love review. So we're on the Aquarians for the month of March reading, and we're going to be seeing what exactly is happening in each and every week because we got to check out and see what's coming out. Okay, so we're dealing with the first week. Okay, in the first week, some of you blonde ladies is going to be meeting Mr. Casanova. Okay, and Mr. Casanova is this guy who has women all over the place he's full of love he's like oh girl i think that you are the one but he's gonna have a lot of information okay this man he will sell you anything but don't get caught up he's quite a nice fella but don't get caught up okay because mr casanova is coming up especially for the blonde ladies out there and um, Mr. Casanova is definitely, definitely coming up. You are going to be meeting him. So be aware and be careful of what is going on because definitely this man is going to be out there. He's going to be humping. He's going to be going at here. He's going to be telling you how much he loves you. But listen to what he has to say. Don't put all your eggs in one basket. Definitely listen to what he has to say because he's going to have a lot to say. He is coming from a place of love. He's in love itself. So remember that these Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion, and this person is between the ages of 18 and 45, is really someone who's very loving. He's very loving. So you blonde ladies out there, you um, blonde ladies out there, be aware, Mr. Casanova is coming in. But as you see... Be careful because he's up to something, okay? There are other, he has a lot of women going on, so be careful. Be careful about the spicy skins or scorpion 
who you're going to be meeting the Casanovas can also come in a different energy okay they can come as someone different so be aware of that also it doesn't have to be a Pisces cancer or a Scorpio he can be here as a, a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn but this man is someone that has a whole lot of women all over the place and he sees you and you're beautiful and he wants to get involved okay all right, let's look at what else could be coming out for the mature women in week um, one for the mature women. And this is like, you know, the women who knows like 35 and older for the mature women, 35 and older, what you're dealing with. You're dealing with, um, and this, this is definitely you. Some of you, um, you could be um, dealing with, this could be a girlfriend or something like that, or you could be finding out that your partner is in relationship with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius. So you mature women, um, be careful, um, obviously. And this person, you could find out that if you're dealing with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius, that this person is married and they didn't tell you. So be aware, okay? Whoever the person is, it is, could also be a same sex relationship, but they're married and they didn't say anything to you. So be careful. But for the rest of you, mature women, 35 years and older, it's going to be powerful. It's going to be good. Some of you could be meeting someone who is a fire sign that is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius, or it could be your husband. Some of you could find out about infidelity that your partner is seeing someone else, and that person is an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius. So be a really careful about what is going on. Really, really careful. Okay. Now there is going to be some love triangles. Some of you are going to be finding out that your partner infidelity in the first week. You're going to be finding out that your partner is seeing someone else, some infidelity. Definitely the energy of the devil is in reverse, okay? Um, and your spirit guides is going to be alerting you. So if you feel as if, hey, my partner said he was going to do this, but it's not there and I'm trying to call him, he's not picking up, something is happening. Ladies and gentlemen, listen to your intuition because something else is going on. And this is going to be coming up in the first week for you Aquarians. So be aware of what is transpiring and what is happening because it's going to be really unbelievable what you're going to be finding out. You're going to be finding out that whoever it is, whoever your partner is, is not being very honest. And it could be um, the men finding out that your partner isn't being honest. So you Aquarian men could be finding out that your partner is in a love triangle, that there is someone else in your relationship because your intuition, your intuition is here to tell you that. Okay. So be aware, be aware Alrighty, we're going to be looking at the second week of March, seeing what is coming out. Okay, the second week of March is really, really, really um, wonderful because it is a week of friendship for some of you. Some of you could be meeting someone, um, and this is uh, as you met the pe the person, you felt as if, oh my God, it's as if I've known this person for a lifetime, okay? And it is going to be um, a message from your spirit, okay? So it's, do you see that this is in the reverse? It's a message from your spirit that is saying, this is someone who you have known from a lifetime. If you connect with a person right away, you're going to understand that this is someone who came in to help you on your journey. It's not going to be a relationship. It's just going to be a friendship and it's going to be a very um, good friendship. You could meet me meeting this person on the work floor. You could be meeting this person as you go out, but it's going to be very positive because someone is coming as a friend that is going to be coming in in a positive energy. You know, you can meet people and the friendship you met people and it's like, mm, I don't know, but yet still this person is very good. Okay. Now we have some fun times coming up in the second week. This is fun with your relationship with your partner. If you're single, go out there. Go out there. Don't sit at home. Go out there. If you are single, go out there. Okay. Some of you could be connecting with other people in organizations. Some of you could be going out on dating 
or dating site, that sort of a thing. If you're single, and this is really for the single people, what is happening and what is transpiring, it's as if you are afraid to open up yourself to love. You got to let go, girlfriend. Let go, open up to love because love is going to be coming in, okay? Whatever is transpiring, go out there and have some fun because it's going to be happening for you, Aquarians, in the second week. As we look at the third week, what we have... We have some of you who just like to date. Some of you are going to be um, just dating, just going out, looking for the right person, you singles. Some of you can be singles. Some of you won't be singles. Some of you are going to be finding out that um, your partner might be seeing someone who's seen other people, that sort of a thing. And um, you're going to end it, okay? Um, somehow you're going to speak to this lady and said, this is not what I want. Or you're going to say to your partner, hey, this is not what I want. So whatever the situation is and whatever is transpiring, some of you are going to be finding out that someone is flirting with your partner, okay? And you are going to end it, okay? You're going to be like, no, hell no. Um, you're always over the place, always dating other people. I don't want that in my life. Some of you, on the other hand, is going to think, hey, I'm single. I'm going to go out there single and mingle. But you're going to be coming in some problems, okay? Because people don't like like when women are, are, are you know single and they're mingling and they're at a party and they're talking some women are not going to like that and they're going to be causing conflict in your life so be careful can be women can be men um be careful in the second week as we look at the third week you aquarians i'm loving this third week you aquarians are going to be meeting a twin flame or a soulmate so you aquarians in the third week is going to be meeting your twin flame and soulmate yes 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 you are going to be meeting someone you could be receiving message let's say that someone is just like okay i've known you from the past i've been seeing you and you're going to start talking to this person you're going to realize oh my god it's as if i've known this person my heart speak to this person their heart speak to my heart this is just going to be good because you are going to have a strong foundation if you are in a soulmate relationship already and it has been a lot of work it has been rocky a lot of work and you're going and you're trying to it's going to be okay you are going to be okay this relationship is going to be good so expect that some of you are going to be meeting someone and this person is going to speak to your heart like you never felt before and this is going to become a very a stable relationship okay this is going to be a very good relationship some of you um might be looking for someone and you're going to be meeting someone and it could be someone that you have met a long time ago or you know from childhood or you know someone just unexpectedly popped up back in your life go for it because you are going to be building a strong foundation with this person there's someone from a past soul life and they are good for you okay third week you aquarians damn 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 especially the singles especially for people who are looking for a relationship the third week is going to be good because you're going to be going out on dates you can't sit at home and just expect that guy to come in you've got to go out you aquarians and trust me trust me you aquarians don't sit at home please go out connect however way you're going to find new people connect because you are going to be coming against the right person at the right time some of you are going to be going out on dates and it's going to be a very successful date so do it just do it okay whoever decide um, if someone is setting you up on a blind date it's going to be good so it's going to be good go for it you Aquarians it's just going to be so powerful so good what else is happening in the third week for love some of you men 45 years and older you're definitely having a situation um, with your child's mother so some of you it could be you having a situation with your son father there is a lot of conflicts okay so in the third week some of you um, could be having some relationship problems with um, your husband it could be with your um, boyfriend it could be your ex-partner 
and this is going to be transpiring this is going to be happening there's going to be some conflicts but it will be resolved only the people who have kids only the people who have kids okay it could be a child's father that is out but it's going to be working out so don't worry about it it is definitely definitely going to be very positive and going to be clearing up as we look at the fourth and last week for you Aquarians in love it's all about the family all about the family my darlings it's really really all about the family and what is happening and what is transpiring is that happy family okay whatever the situation that was transpiring in your family life it is going to be good some of you new babies could be born a lot of new people could be coming in your life the wheel of fortune is here so you guys are very lucky extremely extremely lucky you Aquarians are very very lucky um, and you Aquarians are um, especially in the family arena um, in love it's uh, there's a lot of love that is going to be flowing to you okay so it's good especially with family alrighty let's see what else is happening um, for the man some of you could be meeting this Caucasian his blonde blue eyes or his blue eyes oh my god some of you could be in relationship with this man and find out that this man is playing a game be aware okay some of you could be in relationship with this young man and you find out that this man has been not honest because there you are the queen especially the latest 45 years and older you could be finding out that this man is not being very honest if you are in a relationship with a man who is younger than you are there's gonna be some sadness because you're gonna be finding out that this man is playing you be aware of this you're going to be finding out that this man is playing you ladies and gentlemen be aware the last and final um, energy some of you Aquarians are going to be communicating <clears throat> text messages phone calls trying to figure out why this man isn't paying enough attention to you because obviously this man is just not paying enough attention to you you're trying to text him you're waiting for his call you're texting him not getting back any response you're sitting there thinking what is going on why isn't he the eight of swords okay you're very worried because there was someone who you met and all of a sudden now you are not seeing whatever that is happening and you need to understand that if you meet a man and you know you have text a couple of times and he's not answering your text and that sort of a thing let it go let it go let it go I know your ear sign I know you want to know what is happening but this man has no interest he has a lot of fires that is going on he has a lot of other people that is going on so be aware of this you Aquarians okay because this could be happening if you realize that you know you have been texting you're wondering what happened I haven't heard from him why is he why am I not hearing anything obviously he's out doing something quite happy and that sort of a thing let it go okay so please leave a message about this reading we're going to be going forward and doing the Gemini um, love reading for the month of July and I'm glad I'm doing this online so I can give you a lot of time because I'm trying to figure out how I can make my readings much longer and um, please leave a message please leave a timestamp we are going to go and look at the Gemini overall it's a month from a lot of things that is happening in relationship there is so much that is happening in relationship and you can see I'm going week by week some weeks will um, connect with you some weeks won't.